So I'm making this video for all of my lashes who do mobile work, who may someday get a client who uh, flies in places. I know that a lot of makeup artists already do this. A lot of makeup artists get booked to do location shoots. And so for makeup artists and hairdressers, this is like easy no brainer, but I thought I'd make a video showing everyone what I pack for uh, that mobile client. She flies me all over the place. So um, I kind of need to be ready for everything. This is her kit. It has my mirror in it with my metallic um, magnifying mirror on there. Um, my glue, a backup glue in case something happens with my glue for some reason. Tissue tape, three pairs of iPads because you never know if they're going to need to get up in the middle of it or if something happens. You, I have used three pairs of iPads on this client in a single appointment before, so it's smart. Um, and then just some like disposable tools, the spoolies and doe feet and all of that stuff in there. Um, this holds my tweezers. I know that this is not approved for state board in California to have your tweezers together like this, but while I travel, this is what I travel with. Um, my goggles that I use for lashing. I'll pull those out in a second. Some micellar water just to clean her lashes just in case or to add a little bit of moisture. Um air puffer in case it gets fumey uh, mint because whatever sometimes you need a mint. need a mint and then these are the lashes I use for her I use mink lashes on her only so that's what's in the kit we'll bag that up nicely here in a moment underneath the kit I have my little work tray this is the tray that I like to work off while I'm lashing because I don't like to work off the bed or the table because sometimes you get glue on the beds, you know, things get a little bit messy. I like to keep, like to keep everything on here um, because I can clean it off in between clients and it's a nice little work area and this holds my tools up here. It's actually a collapsible cutting board. I'll link that. Then over here I have a brand new clean headrest for her, her neck rest because she likes this one. She doesn't like the one that comes with her table. Um, for me personally, oh, and then also lash bath, which is my lash bath. And I'm going to give this to her when I see her, it just came out. Um, and then I have, this is for me. <laughs> this is for me because travel, I travel a lot for this client and I get a little tired. So these are my babe lash, um, under eye gel patches. They help to hydrate my skin, make me just feel a little better. Um, my glasses, of course, so I can see airport terminal things um, my chargers for my apple watch my iphone and then i don't trust myself with those cordless ones so i keep the og corded headphones this is one of my new favorite things i've actually had it for a while but with everything that happened with corona i have not been able to use it yet kitsch made all these travel sets that match so shampoo and conditioner, I'll put some like leave-in conditioner in one of these. I could either, I could also use these for shampoo and conditioner. Um, this for any sort of like powders or pills or eye creams or anything that I want to put in there. So I can put all my favorite products into all of these. And in these little guys, I think I'm actually going to put like my, um, my moon milk in here, my collagen moon milk, my, my blueberry, whatever it's called. I'll link that as well. So I love these sets. I can't wait to use these today. This is my... This is my Lululemon fanny pack. Um, I love using this when I travel because I keep my wallet in there, my hand cream, because you have to wash your hands a thousand times at the airport. Hand cream, wallet, cell phone also goes in there. And then I always have just a little um, hand wipe in there just in case something happens. Um, my face masks, of course, Kitsch. We all have seen this one. Kitsch, and then this is Uniglow, just a nice plain black one from Uniglow, and then this is just a stylish little hanky just in case. This is my dop kit with all my personal items and my makeup in there. And then for travel, I just bought these Hanes Kids tank tops. Um, I bought mine in size extra large, I think. Yeah, extra large. I bought a pack of five of them. They're great to go underneath um, your outfits, your travel outfits, and your work outfit, to be honest with you. Um, I just got this little sweatsuit from Nike. 
Uh, it's nice, plain green, looks good. It's cohesive, it goes together. Um, I don't wanna look, I wanna look put together at the airport, but I wanna be warm because it's always cold there. So um, I like to dress in layers. Green is my favorite color, so I threw that with it. That's my airport um, outfit on the way there. I love, sorry about my slippers. I love these aloe uh, knit sneakers because you can just pull them on, no laces. Um, if you don't have TSA pre-check, these are amazing. If you do have pre-check, they're still amazing. Um, this is going to be my work outfit again with the Hanes tank tops. Love these for work. I got these leggings from Uniglo. I'm five feet tall and these fit me perfectly. I got the size small, they're nice and thick. And then I got a black Uniglo, just plain crew neck sweater because again, I wanna be comfortable while I'm lashing. I cannot wear jeans while I'm lashing. I just can't breathe. <laughs> so I like to wear leggings and crew neck sweatshirts and then <clears throat> just layer this underneath in case I get hot. And when I show up, I will be wearing this over my work outfit. This is also from Uniglo. And it's super soft. It kind of looks like a trench coat when you wear it, but it feels like a freaking sweater. And I got it on sale. It was $99, obviously. I got it for $89, so $90 for this. Pretty good deal. Has pockets. Really comfortable. I'll take a picture of this outfit while I'm wearing it. And then when I pack my bags, I love to put them in these cow pack, the luggage separator cases. So I'll put all my clothes into one pack and then the rest of the, my suitcase goes towards my client's um, products, her stuff. <laughs> and then lastly, this is another one of my favorite pieces. This is also from CalPAC. Um, this is their, their, you know, weekender bag, basically. Um, tons of room, lots of pockets. I like to bring a book, of course, a pillow for the plane because I need to be comfortable and a little cashmere blanket because again, I don't like to get cold. And then I buy one plastic water bottle and I'll use that for like six months and I'll just refill it at the airport. That's why I have an empty water bottle in here because I'll fill it up when I get there. And like I said, I'll reuse this bottle for like six to nine months. Um, the other thing I like about this bag is that it has this underneath area that opens up. So I will probably put my um, little over jacket in that underneath area. And that is everything. That's how I pack my bag to go to my clients. Here is the final packing job. These are all my clothes, just in this thing right here. Toiletries and my clients' uh, tools and supplies and products. The end. Oh, and my under seat thingy.